We'll be chilling and having a good, good time Doesn't matter if the snow is falling Or the windows in the rain is pouring It will always be Christmas in my heart But this year I wanna hang out with my friends and family Making angels in the sand you read me Doesn't matter if it's Christmas in my heart Hey guys, welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you're new and if you're new make sure to stick around because we're doing Vlogmas this year and this is Vlogmas Day 11 and it's been 11 vlogs already, I can't believe it. I'm so excited for all the other Vlogmas that are coming along. I have it planned for the things that I want to do for certain days and I'm super excited for you guys to see those. So today I decided to wear my little fur jacket just to stay nice and cozy and then the spirit of Christmas and being Christmas themed. Um, I got my little thing on the TV right here, the little fire going and my little setup. So today we started the vlog a little bit later than usual but it's okay because I want to talk to you guys about uh, our traditions that we're starting this year. So traditions that we're starting this year traditions that I want to start next year because Adeline's still too small and as she grows up she'll understand it more and even other traditions that I would either like to try out or I wanted to mention just in case one of you guys would be interested in doing those traditions so there's different traditions okay you guys so I had to stop the video really quick um, because I forgot to mention to you guys that mommy's princess was actually taking a nap and then I had to sit her down and have her snack and, and she's actually right here walking around right now I'm gonna show you guys right now there she is so I'm gonna show you a little bit more of Adeline uh, we're gonna go to the playroom because I have to um, take care of a video that I have to finish editing and upload it and I also have to work on some DIYs but there are Christmas DIYs that I'm gonna be getting done and I'm so excited for and Adeline gets to play in her playroom while I work so that's fun let's go ahead and go to the playroom Yay! It is! I'm not going to show you guys because um, even though I know what my present is, um, I don't want my mom to see. And if she knows that I got her like something from Uggs, she's going to know exactly what it is. So I hope that she doesn't watch this video, which I doubt that she will because uh, Vlogmas, there's going to be a lot of videos and I'll just make sure that she doesn't watch this one. But I'm so excited and um, yeah. Just wanted to mention that I got my package and I'm so excited, you guys. So we're in the playroom. Her playroom's actually a little bit messy because we were here earlier, but it's not too bad. Um, so I'm just gonna have her play for a little bit while I do my work. It's white outside. Christmas with 
so okay you guys so i ended up losing this part of the uh vlog this footage unfortunately so i'm gonna have to refilm this part of the vlog which is just talking with you guys and telling you a little bit about my new traditions um i have a list of traditions that i wanna that i'm gonna continue with my new family and that i'm also gonna add and also ideas that i wanna you know maybe just um try out down the line but i'm actually at my parents house right now um I, I actually decided to sit right behind a white wall because why not so i do do most of these things um already way before i had adeline and all of that um but some um i get to do start with her as she grows up so i did start some of them this year but some of them she's really not gonna understand it just yet i think next year she'll be more into it so i'm so excited for that um so i'm gonna go ahead and get started and go through the list that i have i have a long list really long list over here about all of, um, all the traditions so i moved my camera a little bit um i have a different angle also i'm filming on my phone um so if you see a quality change that's why um but the new iphone quality is amazing i love it so it should be fine anyways so the first one i want to talk about is actually something that we me and my family always did um which was having christmas eve i know some people do like christmas eve they'll open the presents and then christmas morning they do like the santa presents but what we do is we take um we have a christmas eve event a party a get together with our family close friends and stuff like that we have really delicious dinner we dress up nicely we take pictures you know and stuff like that i like to do games i like you know things like that so that's one of the uh traditions um i know a lot of people do it um I'm pretty sure a lot of Hispanics do it mostly. But then on Christmas Day, we go ahead and dress up in our pajamas and stay in our pajamas all day. And we go ahead and open our presents. So the way we like to do that is after we wake up, uh, whatever time we wake up, we all got to be awake and we all got to be do, the, do it together. We don't like to leave anybody out, even if we have like people over or anything like that. And we go ahead and make breakfast we have our breakfast and then we start opening the gifts uh we sit around the christmas tree or like you know near the christmas tree and then each person and then each person has a turn kind of like a spotlight they sit right in front of all of us and they open all their gifts um all together so that's what we like to do we take turns with everybody and um i'm so excited for this year because adeline's gonna have so many presents i think we're gonna leave her for last to open her presents that way it'll be like ending things in the best way possible i can't wait to see the smile on my baby's face you guys i'm so excited my parents got her a few things too i got her so many things my brother got her like two things i believe and i just can't wait if you haven't done so already i did do what my my toddler got for christmas so if you want to check that out i'll link it down below the other tradition that i always have kept is making gingerbread houses so um i started that when my brother and i were really really young and then my brother and i will always do a gingerbread house each of us together we'll listen to christmas music or whatever type of music and we sit down and we talk and we decorate our houses so i'm super excited for adeline to get her own little house to to do hopefully next year i don't know if she'll be she'll still be too young but i'll probably let her do like one of those small small ones so that she could just probably she'll probably smash it or something i don't know <laughs> definitely want to continue pictures with santa so this year with everything going on and and the way things are i'm not gonna be able to take her to get pictures with santa but i do have a friend that has the santa costume and she's gonna let me borrow that so um we're actually gonna pick that up today and we're gonna we actually will have a video of on that too one of our vlogmas days and um we're just gonna have my husband dress up as santa claus and we'll take her pictures with robert that would be so funny and even though it's not going to be like very professional or whatever, the, her pictures with Santa, that would be close enough and it'll be really cute. I'm so excited. But as the year goes by, if everything comes back to normal, of course, I will do pictures with Santa, going, bringing her to the mall or wherever and, um, and getting her pictures that way. 
decorate the christmas tree so we already have a vlog up on decorating the christmas tree together uh adeline was actually sitting in her high chair and she was having a snack and my husband and i were fluffing up the christmas tree so i definitely want to make sure that i encourage decorating the christmas tree um you know putting up the christmas tree and decorating it putting the lights everything um all three of us me and my husband and my daughter and we just put up the christmas tree and decorate it together i love to do that because growing up that was something very special that we used to do myself my mom and usually my brother my dad will just be in the corner there but he was always with us but um i loved doing that very important one that i love to do is looking at christmas lights so we either go to a park some sort of like drive through this year we went through to a drive through christmas lights this year we actually went to a drive through uh christmas lights it was so beautiful and i believe it was uh called candy crush and it's by six flags or something like that um and i love that i actually have a video that um video clips that i'm gonna add to one of my blogs and you guys will see that is beautiful um i love doing that i definitely want to continue that tradition we used to do it when we used to live back in massachusetts and um we used to go to this park and we used to drive through and just look at all the lights and it's just beautiful so i definitely want to keep that tradition there's a park here in georgia that's called stone mountain and they have the beautiful lights but you don't it's not like drive through but you go in and it they have like santa claus they have shows they have like snow that's feels just like real snow and a whole bunch of other fun things watching christmas movies is a must for me I love Christmas movies. Yes, yes, I do. My favorite thing to do is just to like watch a Christmas movie. I was actually watching one yesterday and um, I'll just kind of lay down when I need a break and watch my Christmas movie. And definitely that's a must to do together as a family. I love watching Christmas movies. Baking Christmas cookies. I love baking and I want to make sure that I get better at like decorating the cookies so that when Adeline grows up, she can do it along with me. Um, and baking Christmas cookies is always a must, especially on Christmas Eve because you want to leave the cookies for Santa. So I definitely want to make sure that that's a tradition that we keep. Something that we haven't started yet, but I do want to start is decorating or making Christmas ornaments. Um, that would be really cute for me and my daughter to do together. It's arts and crafts. And now uh, we can make our little ornaments and we can collect them as the, the year comes by. This year, I actually have one that I still haven't made that I have to make. is her little handprint on a little like star thing and you like mix it i'm sure you guys have seen those before but um i gotta make that so basically i am starting the tradition so every year i want to make sure that we have at least one ornament that we can collect somewhere and put it somewhere maybe hang it up somewhere i don't know but i'm really excited to do that as well something that i always wanted to do was to have an ugly sweater party or a pajama party um but i always seen it in the movies and i always wanted to do that growing up so i definitely want to do that maybe make our own ugly sweaters or have an ugly sweater party or something along those lines we don't have to do that every single year but something around there having like breakfast for dinner type of thing and stuff like that that would be also fun to do i also want to make sure we do some sort of christmas diys and arts and crafts um we did some this year i made our christmas cards for some of our family members and they came out super cute and i also made sure that adeline was a part of it she kind of like had you guys will see a vlog that will be going up soon um that we also did arts and crafts so i want to make sure i keep doing that every year i did mention this before but i want to make sure that we do cookies for santa every night um on christmas eve we we bake the cookies for santa and have them ready i did make a little plate that says cookies for santa and that will also be in one of my vlogs soon um and i will show you guys how i made it i made it with my cricket having a christmas themed breakfast or a christmas breakfast i actually um did that 
recently and um, i'm going to be posting it someday of the, our next vlogs and you guys will see the camo super super cute i made like little deer pan out of pancakes i made little snowman so definitely love christmas breakfast christmas theme they'll they are so cute so make sure to stay tuned for that so going shopping for gifts um i always always like to do my shopping really really early but um this is also a tradition um i like to usually do my shopping by september ish um even if i can october because because the earlier the better for me and if i find sales especially i always be on the lookout for sales i go ahead and grab it before the prices go up so i like to do that um i like to go out shopping and when you go out and you just find things that you wouldn't find online i really like to do both online and in-store shopping so hopefully that it could be a tradition that my family and i could do all together i'm not sure that my husband will join us on that um but maybe my daughter will like it probably not because i know kids don't really like shopping i remember i used to hate being in the stores when i was younger but if she doesn't it's okay she could always stay with grandma and i guess i'll do it alone or with friends or something like that but that's something i wanted to mention because christmas shopping is always so much fun for me i love giving more than i love receiving so i just this is this time of year is actually my favorite so something we actually started this year is following a Christmas countdown or an advent calendar or whatever you want to call it. So it's um, having a sort of, some sort of calendar or counting down all the way up to Christmas Eve or Christmas Day. Well, Christmas Day. And um, I made, I'm sure you guys have seen it right after my intro. I like to add a little clip of Adeline picking um, out out of the little board I made is numbered 1 through 25. And, and from the 1st of December all the way to the 25th of December, Adeline has been receiving a little item. So I like to buy little things, things that she might need or things that uh, we are going to use down the line. I went ahead and bought 25 items. So I bought a, two pairs of pajamas, which she needed new pajamas. So that was perfect. I bought her a few books. I bought her this set of like um, paint in the bath. And that is actually very inexpensive. It was a whole package. So I decided to, instead of giving her just one, the one box, I decided to take one of each of the little, um, it's like little bottles that has the painting and add like a chocolate with that along with you know so that every day she has something different something fun and i also had like tights that she needed so um some of the days she had her tights and she had some candy as well so it wasn't just the tights even though she's not gonna be into those type of things it's stuff that she needs so she can appreciate that these things that we buy for her that we need she could be grateful even if you know sometimes you get stuff and you don't think about it you know so i want to incorporate writing a letter to santa for her um i definitely want to get some sort of like little mailbox that says letter to santa so that she can know that once we put that letter in there it's gonna go to santa and um it'll be i don't know it'll be really cute to do that um growing up i always wanted to really do that i didn't really write letters i would just tell my mom what i wanted um and my mom would tell santa and uh yeah but i can't wait to do that because that'll be really cute for us to write the letters together that will be something that i'll be adding more down the line to our traditions i'm not sure if next year she'll catch on to it yet but uh, maybe the year after that visit a tree farm so i have i have a fake tree and i prefer fake tree because um it's for me it's less inexpensive to having to buy a tree every year it's also like you know you have to take good care of the real trees and i love real trees and i would definitely do i'm not against it um but i definitely love to go to tree farms um just for like the different things they do s'mores they do hot chocolate they do all type of things so it's really really cute to go and have that experience and i definitely want to start buying at least a small tree for adeline to decorate herself maybe put it in her playroom or something like that so i could do that and we just go to the tree farm not to get a small really really small tree so i kind of mentioned this one already but wearing matching christmas pajamas 
um i love wearing matching christmas pajamas it's actually in our intro you guys already seen it and um we like to do that on christmas day like i mentioned it before and uh and i don't know something about wearing the same thing as a family it's just the cutest thing taking pictures and all of that so i love it so there are millions of traditions and ideas and stuff like that that you can do with your family and loved ones there's so many things but the last one that i have in my list is wrapping christmas presents and most likely we'll be wrapping christmas presents separate like if i wrapping christmas presents obviously for adeline i can't wrap it in front of her um it's because you can't really see them but those little presents that we can wrap together like for my parents for my brother we can wrap together and the other ones i'll wrap on my own but i love wrapping christmas presents it's so much fun to me i know a lot of people hate it but i don't know i just love it <laughs> so i wanted to add one last thing that um i just thought of just now and is making the chocolate hot chocolate bombs and they're like these little chocolate bombs that you make out of obviously chocolate when you melt it you add it to like a mold then you put it together well you first put the uh, chocolate powder and you put marshmallows in there and once you have your bomb you go ahead and heat up some milk and you have your hot milk and put the bomb in there or put the bomb in the cup before and then pour the milk and the uh bomb explodes and you mix it up and it's so good so having like a some sort of hot chocolate bar or something like that that would be really fun to do together as a family and yeah that's it for all of our tradition ideas all of my tradition ideas it was a really long list but i hope you guys have been enjoying these vlogs so far um i do have to catch up on some of the editing but i will be catching up really really soon based on my plan so i hope you guys have been enjoying these videos i will be doing a giveaway really really soon so stay tuned for that i hope you guys have happy holidays and enjoy time with your family which is the most important part and if you don't get to be with your family because i know unfortunately a lot of people can't be with their families for work or whatever the, whatever the reasons may be make sure to call them facetime them do something that you can uh somehow interact with each other even though you're not together together because it still counts you know it makes you feel good to be able to do that with your family family is so important you guys so don't forget to subscribe hit the subscribe button turn on your notification the little bell um so that you be notified every time i post a new video and you guys know i am posting almost every day for the month of december and i will be posting two videos for some of the days just to catch up on some of the videos that i'm behind on and i will be catching up really soon i hope and um also give me a thumbs up it really helps my channel out and yeah i hope i love you guys so much and i appreciate you watching this video bye guys Merry Christmas to you.